animal hot be lag be a ito was at bohimaran a harfi hana last the bomb what i can't hear anything uh, is 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 this working to, can you see me yes um, marhaban hello Hello. It's working. Oh. oh, I hear you. I see you. Secretary of State, Condoleezza Rice, it is my dream of dreams to be talking with you. It is my honor. Uh, you have my deepest apologies. Uh, the plans for us to meet at my palace, unfortunately, the taboo. Do not cooperate and leave you tantalizingly close in the Mediterranean. In another week, they will be crushed and eliminated as a problem. I can promise you that. I was so looking forward to meeting in your lovely home. Oh, the same house. The very house where your Hollywood President Reagan dropped six tons of U.S. bombs. It is ironic. Yes? <laughs> President Bush sends his best regards, Colonel. And I personally want to thank you for fulfilling your commitment to the families of the victims lost in the locker before. Making payments does not admit guilt. I've made this long journey because the United States desires to improve relations with Libya. You do not come for this reason. Yeah. We are looking forward to a productive partnership between our two countries. That a really partnership important. with, as you refer to us, um, as a state sponsor of terrorism. How many times has the United States proposed United Nations sanctions on my country? To, Human rights violations. How many? We believe Libya is vital in helping deter proliferation of weapons of mass destruction on the African continent. You do not think I know your Texas president's hunger for oil, that I do not see the oil tankers massed on our borders. You are not dealing with primitive Bedouin, Madam Secretary. You are in the presence of Colonel Muammar bin Mohammed Abu Minyar Gaddafi, brotherly leader of the great socialist peoples, Libyan Arab Jamahari, for the last 37 years. You have rescinded the Libyan constitution, abolish laws. There have been countless murders, an, an epidemic of murders, brutal disappearances, scores of people have been hanged in public by your death squads. Your ruthless regime is a stain on humanity. Colonel Gaddafi, I know exactly who you are. As surely as the glorious sun rises, the glorious sun giver of life rises, 
Your President Bush lusts for Libya's vast oil fields as I lust for you. I could positively eat you up. Um, unfortunately, Colonel, my, my time in Tripoli is limited, so... A thousand nights I dream of this, of tearing off what you call your pantsuit <laughs> and making enormous love with you. The United States views this historic meeting as a stepping stone. Sit, sit, sit. As a stepping stone on the path to a lasting... I beg you for all things holy, please. Sit. Huh? Even on this small screen, you are more beautiful than I imagine. Your skin glows with animal sex. Why? Why, thank you. That's very nice. Colonel Gaddafi, we... Oh, call me Mumu. We believe the issue of utmost importance... Will you call me Mumu? ...is to forge closer... You call me Mumu. Mumu. <gasps> Make my heart sore. ...is to forge closer ties. With you, my ebony goddess, I would forge closer ties any hour of any day. Oh, but first, gifts, gifts for you from me. Oh, Colonel, please, I... Ah, uh, Mumu. Um, Mumu. Uh, <laughs> this is for you, my black flower. A diamond pin to remember me in your heart. Well, thank you, but... By, by U.S. law. I also have for you a Libyan lute to play our love songs during, during those long desert nights. I can't accept. I'm sorry. And theory for a new world society, my book. To my black flower in the White House from your desert stallion. Colonel, thank you for your thoughtfulness. As my time here unfortunately is limited, I'd, I'd like to discuss establishing a designated region in Africa free of weapons of mass destruction. I have saved the best for last, <laughs> an album of photographs of you. Oh, of, of me. Page after page. Each one more beautiful than the last. I worship you, my beauty. I have a song written for you <clears throat> by our country's great composer. Oh. Oh. Lisa, 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 black flower of the house that is white. You torture me with beauty bright, black flower of the white house, so beautiful, so smart. Everybody, black flower of the white house, a classic piece of 
Art. That's uh, lovely. Thank you. In regard to the weapons of mass destruction. My weapon of mass destruction is swollen with love for you. My, my Lisa, please don't leave. On behalf of President Bush and the American people, I'd like to thank you for your courtesies today. And I hope we can continue our talks on such a productive level. Lisa! Lisa, Lisa! You, you break my heart. Mumu. Yes, my burning love. I want you and I together to lead our countries past the history of our difficulties, to forge a future together, you and I. It will take courage. It will take bravery, it will take intelligence, it will take a leader, it will take a special man. I am that man. To work together, to establish a WMD ban. Be my partner. I will be your partner. Oh, let me be your partner in restoring the Libyan constitution. You will be my partner. I will work toward my new partner's entry back into the world community. And for that, what price will you exact? Your friendship. Our countries will be friends. You and I will be friends. You are very impressive, Madam Secretary. Well, Colonel, your place in the world is well earned. When you tire of serving the United States as Secretary of State, come here to Libya. You could be 